Thank you, David. Economic development officials are sorting through more than 7,000 names of people who responded to Governor Kristi Noem's Freedom Works Here campaign, trying to determine who is serious about moving to South Dakota. For those unfamiliar with the Freedom Works Here campaign, it's designed to bring more skilled workers from other states and entice them with all South Dakota has to offer. According to the campaign's website, some of the main appeals for out-of-state workers are high wages, 20,000 job openings, and no personal income tax. South Dakota Newswire Investigative reporter Stu Whitney says while the 7,000 people said to be interested in moving to the Mount Rushmore state is promising, many economic development officials are frustrated, saying these stats may be misleading and not representative of the workers known was trying to attract. This is a multifaceted, complex issue in terms of workforce recruitment. A couple of commercials, you know, that get some nationwide play are not going to solve the, this issue. But I think some people are frustrated by this uh, more of a political uh, approach to this rather than a, a workforce recruitment strategies that is going to take, you know, a statewide uh, cooperation to really have an impact. Whitney also said economic development officials wanted more work done on the front end, such as finding out where people were planning to move within the state, as well as what profession they were looking to get into.